welcome back to Cantati Plans. This is Carmen. If you are new here, welcome. And if you're returning, thank you so much for coming back. Here in my channel, I show you guys how I functionally and I decoratively plan my planner spreads for the weeks and for the months. And today I'm going to be planning in my classic vertical happy planner that I use as my catch-all planner for the week of July 29th through August 4th. So let's go ahead and get to planning. So you guys saw me lift this pack of stickers and yes, Today is going to be the Olympics 2024 theme spread. I have these awesome Olympic theme stickers from Anna Bean on a Mission. I'll go ahead and link her information down below. This was part of her, I think, monthly club subscription, but she was so kind to send these to me because she's just so sweet like that. And so I am excited to use these. I love the Summer Olympics. Uh, I don't watch every single sport but I do like a few like swimming women's gymnastics track and field and a couple of others so I am going to be watching a few of the games and the games began on July 26 which was last Friday but they're going to last through August 11th I believe so this is a perfect time to go ahead and put down uh, Olympics theme spread so I have all these awesome stickers here go USA and so I'm going to use these these are not the only ones that came in that kit but I'm going to save the other ones for maybe some other planner spreads that I have so you may see some more of these stickers reappear in different spreads but yeah I got a little bit of everything on here so let's go ahead and get this going I'm actually filming this video on let's see what's today Saturday, July 27th. So the opening ceremonies just happened. They were so cool. I love to watch that. Let's see, we're going to put this down first at the bottom, right here. Kind of center it on the page a little bit. So how are you guys doing this week? I hope you guys are doing well. I hope that you're happy and that you're healthy and that everything is going well for you. Let's see. Okay. Not perfect, but it looks good. I kind of want to I wanted to center it with the page, not so much three these three boxes. So that's why it's a little off. And then I'm going to do the same thing with this. So these are the colors of the Olympics. So very colorful. All right. Okay, we're done. No, I'm just kidding. Um Super cool. And then these stickers, I don't know if you guys noticed when I showed them to you. Let me see if I can bring it up a little bit. But they have all the little flags of all the different countries, which is really cool. So I'm going to take this one that has the Olympic rings, and I'm going to put it up at the top here as well. I'll try to line it up as best as I can. Um, hmm. Now this one, I think I may have to do some trimming because I do want this one to just to be here because I am going to put a sidebar sticker down. So well, let me see. Oh, let me lift this back up. That's not where I wanted it to go. So I want the Olympic rings to be right here. Uh, it'd be nice if I could get things down straight. Okay, if getting stickers down straight would be an Olympic sport, I don't know how great I would be at it. Okay, and I'm gonna get my ruler, maybe use a washi cutter, I think, a washi cutter, and then my X-Acto knife, so I can go ahead and make that cut. Okay, so we're gonna do like this, and I need my tweezers try to lift this up Oop. here we go here we go there we go and then do the same to this side over here I usually put down my functionals first but today I kind of wanted to start with the washi that I was going to use just because I don't always use washi in all of my spreads so since I was going to use it in this one, I kind of wanted to figure out where all that was going to go first so that I could then put my functional boxes around that. 
Okay, so we've got that. Now we're gonna take this other piece and we're going to put it right here. And I think this one's the link right here. Uh, I'll do it upside down here so I can try to get it straight. And it's almost the length of all the boxes here. So I'm just going to set it right there. Okay. That looks good. All right, so we've got kind of like a frame around our spread for the week. And then I'm gonna go back in here. I don't know where they went. The box, or the long box for here. Here it is. So I'm gonna take this blue box here, because it's the only long box that came with the kit. And I am going to put it right in here. Try to get it inside that box as best as I can. Okay. All right. So we've got that. And then, see, I have these that were left. So I'm thinking this is something I could do so I don't have to get rid of them. But then they do seem part of the spread. Put one there and put this other one in this corner. There we go. And it still ties in so and then i got these bullet points that i may use a little bit later i'm gonna put those to the side for right now okay and here we go now we're ready for our functional boxes so we've got blue so next is going to be black black or yellow i don't know is it blue yellow black green yeah, I think it's yellow next. Let's do yellow. I'm gonna try to follow the order of the rings. Okay, so let's do here. And then one here. And then let's see, I had bullet points. So trash day is going to be on Monday. So I'm gonna take one of these so I can put that down. Put it down here, write it down. Okay, and then next is going to be black. So I'm gonna take the black. And since this is here. I'm just going to put this. I'm going to leave a little bit of space between the washi and the box. And then I'm going to do this. Again, a little bit of space. Okay, so we got blue, yellow, black, then green. Green would be next. Let's do this. And then we'll do this one here. So we got our boxes for the first half of the week. I'm gonna switch over to this side. And so after green would be red. So I'm gonna take two reds i guess or no i'm gonna put the other yellow one so i know yellow it means trash because this week is a trash and recycle day for us so i'm gonna put down that and then this okay and then i'm going to take a red box Put it down here. Red box. Another big box here. Now, if you guys notice, I'm putting all of my boxes more towards the top and nothing really towards the bottom. That's only because I don't tend to have too much going on in the evenings. We have an early bedtime now, so um, that's the reason behind that. Try to leave a little bit of space. I believe I have one more Zoom meeting here. I'll put that down there, because that's still red. And then we're gonna circulate back to the beginning of the rings, to the blues. So 
weekend on the weekends we tend to stay up a little bit later so i'm going to switch the order of the boxes so i'm going to put the boxes now towards the bottom right here and then there there we go so I have blue and then we're back at yellow but i ran out of yellows um so what should i do so we don't have yellow so it's okay we'll just skip over it and then we'll go to the blacks and let's see this It's a little low. Let me see. Trying to make it a little bit higher. There we go. And you know, Saturdays we tend to do a lot more of the chores around the house and stuff like that. So I'm gonna add another one just in case we need it. Okay, and then here we try to go back to an early schedule, an early sleep schedule here. Oh, no more blacks. Now what's next? Green, green. I'm glad I caught that before I started putting down the black boxes. Okay, we bring over the green. So here, and then we'll put a green box over here at the top. Okay. All right, and so we have our boxes in. The reason why I have so many boxes this week is because I am gonna try to catch as much of the Olympics as I can. So uh, hopefully I can document which sports I watched, which days. Well, I don't know how much I'll be able to keep up with that, but that's the goal. Okay, so now time to decorate. And of course, I need to put down a Team USA right here. Maybe on the sidebar this week, I can keep track of the medal count. I think that would be a good idea. So I'm going to put this down here. And do I have something that says gold or medal count? No, but I have these little uh, icons that are little medals. So this is what we'll do. These are small, so I can put them here. So keep track of how many golds we've earned this week and how many silvers and bronze. So we got gold, silver, and bronze. Okay, and I'll keep track of that there. I gotta put somewhere here that it's the Paris Olympics, right? So I'm gonna do, let me do this across the bottom here. Paris 2024, and then I'm going to put one of these that has the rings right in here. Looks good. Okay. And then maybe put this across here. Okay. And I have more bullet points here. That's good. I'd love to put these flags up, the ones that are showing everyone's flags. Let's see, where could I put them though? Let me see. I think these are really cool. These could be coming down from here like that. That would be cool. Oh, but I'm covering most of the washi doing that. Maybe like going upward from here. Okay, that's cool. I'm gonna do that here. Where am I gonna put this? Maybe coming upward from where it says Paris down here, kind of coming up like this. I'm going to have to move the Paris 2024 
I'll just move it over. I don't have to like take it out of there. But, like it could still go here. Let me see. I need some scissors to kind of just trim around the white space and make sure I just leave 2024 on here. And do the same over here on this side. Okay. So we can put this. Ooh, you know what? No, no, no. Got an idea. Paris 2024. We're just gonna break it up and put this down at the bottom here and put this up here. There we go. Oh, but it's so crooked. But yes, that's where I want that to be. Only thing is, I don't want it to be crooked. There we go. And then we do have room to do this now, which is great. All right, cool. Love it. And then I have some of these that are like the sports. Not all the sports, but some of the sports. So I think what I want to do, since I have just two big ones like this, Put this down in spots that have big openings. So maybe here, for example, we can do like this. And then we can do again over here where there's like an opening, do like this. And we have some smaller ones, like these little circles, which are cool. And they have more of the games on them. Um, and then we can put those, like, throughout the page where there's an opening. So here. And maybe over here. Huh one here do I have room I have more of these like they're a little bit different we got soccer I put soccer somewhere put it over here and all my other boxes I don't have that much room but I can try to make it work And see, I have these other ones. I don't think I showed them to y'all. These right here, these are cool. They're kind of big though. I'm gonna try to squeeze some of these in where I can. These, this is a gymnastics one. So I wanna definitely put that down. Actually, the one of the gymnastics events I'm gonna watch, they start over the weekend, I think, one's on Sunday and the other one's on Tuesday so I think I did have some room on Tuesday to put in a big sticker so I'm gonna try to put that in yeah here we go here's this so then put this down I like gymnastics I like swimming and then where's running this one here is running so let's try to put this one in somewhere even if it's not on the day that that event's going on I just want it to be there Okay, let's do it here. I think we're good because I don't want to overdo it. Although I think I already did. Let me take one last look. I'm kind of grabbing all the sticker sheets and putting them here to the side. Okay, so it's functional and it's got some deco and I really like how it turned out. It's super Olympics. And I think that with that, I'm done and ready for the week. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please click the like, subscribe, and notification button so you can be notified of my future videos. Thank you so much for your support, and I can't wait to see you guys all in the next one. Bye!